how to fix the VLC is unable to open the MRL file error. Method 1. Verify that the media source is working. Open VLC and click Media in the toolbar. In the Media drop-down menu, select Open Network Stream. Select the URL with which you're getting the error, right-click it, and click Copy. Open your web browser, go to its address bar, right-click it, and click Paste. Hit Enter to access the URL to see if the media source is working. If you can't access the URL, then there's a problem with the streaming service itself, or the URL is incorrect. Method 2. Update the VLC Media Player. Open the VLC Media Player. Open the Help drop-down menu located at the top left of the window. Click Check for Updates. If updates are available, click Yes. Click Install after the updates have been downloaded. Once the update is complete, follow the installation wizard instructions. Method 3. Allow the VLC media player through Windows Defender Firewall. Open the Start menu and type in Allow an app through Windows Firewall, and click the result. Then click Change Settings, and then click Allow another app. Click Browse and navigate to the VLC Media Player Destination folder. Select the VLC.exe file and click Open. Then, click Add. Tick the Private and Public checkboxes next to VLC and click OK. Method 4. Claim File Ownership This method is for those that experience this error when trying to open a local file. Right-click the problematic file, and click Properties. In the Properties menu, navigate to the Security tab and click Advanced. Click the Change button at the top, next to the Owner Information. Click Advanced. Select Find Now. Select Administrators and click OK. Click OK again to save the changes. Then, in the Advanced Security Settings window, click Apply. In the Windows Security Message window, click OK. Click OK to close the Windows Security Settings. In the Properties window, click Edit. Select Administrators and uncheck all of the checkboxes for each permission entry in the Deny column. Click Apply and click OK. Now try to open the media file with VLC again. Method 5. Reinstall the VLC media player. Right-click the Start menu button, and click Apps and Features. 
Scroll through the application list and locate the VLC media player. Select the application, click on install, and click on install again. Click next. Check the delete preferences and cache checkbox and click on install. Once VLC has been uninstalled, open your browser and go to its download website. Click the download button. Then, run the installer, and follow the installation wizard instructions. Thank you for watching.